Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm finally back with another plan with me for the week of July 19th through the 25th. And for this week, I am going to be using the April Mystery from Caress Press, which is a very pretty Japan Sanrio kawaii themed kit, which I just love. So super excited about this one. I just really wanted to get in an anytime kit this summer, so this is the one that I went with because I just think it's so beautiful. So yeah, this is a kit. This is a glossy kit and I believe it's in the full kit format, but don't quote me on that. And then I also picked up the fashion options because I really wanted to use this tall box. And then of course I picked up the foil bundle that came with it. So this is like a sparkly pink. Yeah, pink in the star format. So I picked up two of them because if I only got one, we only get one sheet of the full box overlays that I need at least 10 for a full spread. So I got two sheets of that, the bottom washi and the headers two sheets of the scripts and icons, and then two sheets of the bougie. So yeah, that is it for the kit. I'm gonna go ahead and put down the base of the spread while you guys listen to some music, and then I will be right back. <music>
Alrighty, so let's get on to talking about the day-to-day. -day. I apologize if in the background you hear Winnie and Figaro playing. I managed to film the entire video while they were sleeping. And of course, as soon as I start doing the voiceover, they wake up. So, anyways, Monday morning I went into work, of course, and while I was at work, I had to email my advisor because I had not heard back from him about a certain class I needed to get into. Long story short, I enrolled in classes several months ago for the fall semester, and there was one class in particular that was full, so I had been emailing him and emailing the head of the computer science department, begging them to let me into this class because it was a class that was only offered in the fall of odd years. I'm supposed to graduate in spring of 23, so if I did not get into this class, I would have to come back in fall of 23 just to take a single class in order to get my degree, and that was not going to happen. So finally, I hadn't heard from him in several weeks, and I emailed him again on Monday to try to get an update on this stupid class. Anyways, I also uploaded a video this day, had a headache, was super stressed out, went to bed super early. Moving on to Tuesday, I started off my morning by getting Whataburger before heading into work. That Whataburger script sticker is from Planet Hannah, and you can use my code ALISA15 to receive 15% off your next purchase, or you can just put my name in the notes of seller to receive my freebie. After that, I also marked down that I went to the grocery store during my lunch break. I can't remember what I needed, but it was important enough that I needed to go during lunch. And then I also marked down that I was super stressed because of the whole situation with the class. I got an email back from the, from the advisor saying that he was out of the office for several days, so it was going to be a while before I heard from him, so I was super stressed out about that. And then I also marked down that I got in Winnie's new harness. I purchased a harness for her since I was going to be moving into an apartment. She was going to have to go out on walks to go potty instead of just having the yard to roam around in. So I got that harness in the mail and then I wanted to practice walking her on it. So I marked down that I walked her using a Coffee Monsters Co. Emoti. And then lastly, I marked down that I got Figaro's big boy letterbox in the mail. Wednesday was payday, so I started off marking that down. And then I also marked down that I slept through my alarm this day. So what's new? I do that probably at least once a week at this point. And then I marked down that I went into work, of course. And then I purchased some SPC new releases like I do pretty much every week at this point. I spend way too much money on SPC, if we're being completely honest. And then I also marked down that I watched Prison Break on Hulu. And then finally, I marked down that I was super exhausted. And the exhausted script is from Kinsey's Creations. And I'm so sad that her shop is now closed, so I can't get any more of her scripts. On to Thursday, that was my half day. So I only worked until about 1 o'clock in the afternoon that day and then I went to McAllister's for lunch and got something for me and my sister. And then after we had lunch, I took a much needed nap. So I marked that down using a Joy of Planning character sticker, one of my favorite character sticker shops. And then I also marked down with a Once More With Love Best Day Ever sticker that I got into the class. All of my harassing and sending emails over and over and over again finally worked and the head of the department overrided the capacity for the class and he let me in so super excited about that and then I also marked down that I ran some errands and then on my way home from that I got some gas and I'm really sorry that I was off camera for this I'm in my new apartment and I'm trying to get used to my new filming setup and obviously I need to work on checking that I'm in frame. So anyways, on to Friday. That was my day off. So I spent the morning filming a new video. Love the film script. That is the new font from Planet Hannah, which is becoming one of my absolute favorites. 
and then I marked down and then I went to Target and I just used a little shopping cart icon that came with the foil bundle. I also marked down and then I went to the post office to pick up some happy mail and then of course I organized some stickers when I got home. And finally for Friday, I marked down that I went to go see Black Widow in theaters with a friend from work. The Black Widow character sticker is from Papershire. And I have to say, 10 out of 10 recommend seeing Black Widow if you haven't already. It's definitely probably in my top 5 MCU movies of all time, if I'm being completely honest. I absolutely loved it. I was super excited to go see it in theaters because I honestly can't remember what the last movie I saw in theaters was. It was months before COVID was even a thing, so yeah, highly recommend. Anyways, Saturday, I had marked down that I got a breakfast sandwich and then I went into work in the morning and on my way home, I stopped and got some Taco Bell. I also marked down that I had to sign some FAFSA documents so that they could put my student loans onto my account for the fall semester. And then I marked down that I did laundry and had a YouTube binge. Sunday I went into work again and I mowed the lawn while I was there and of course I took a much needed hot long bath when I got home. And then I pulled stickers and filmed my next plan with me. And then I just had a little cleaning day. And that was pretty much it for my week. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm super excited to be back filming, playing with me's. And of course, like I said, I'm still trying to get used to my new setup. But hopefully videos are going to be regular again. Hopefully two to three days a week I'll upload a video. But yeah, anyways, as always, I'll have all of these shops featured in this plan with me linked in the description box down below for you guys, as well as any coupon codes I might have. And as always, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!